Welcome to XBW TV. My name is Chris Floss, and as you can see, nobody on this screen, this screen, or this screen, and this isn't the Brady Bunch. What I'm here to tell you is that Chris Floss is here and here alone. Joey Styles came in to XPW with Shane Douglas in control of the company. With Shane Douglas in control of Joey Styles. Joey Styles, you've seen him on TV here on XPW TV. Huh? Cool and collected. However, on the inside, Joey Styles was tormented. Was was his morale was being sucked right out of him. He couldn't stand the heat of XPW. So Joey Styles had to get out of the XPW kitchen. He's gone. And as you can see, the host, the true host of XPW is here and here now and forevermore. And next week, we're going to be joined live by a satellite from London, England, once again with the lovely Roxanne Hall. And fans, we're going to have more information on the upcoming event, XPW's New Year's Revolution taking place on January the 17th and the 18th, a double header. But fans, when we return tonight, we're going to take you back to Mary F and Xmas and the XPW World Television title match as Chaos, the champion, defends against Danny Doring. You're not going to believe who the special guest referee enforcer is. But when we return, we're going to take you oh, oh, to the debut of Jayla. I say, say, summon thee. Right now, it is my pleasure to introduce, making her singing debut, Jay Love! Oh, oh, thank you, Carl Winslow! Right now, we're gonna... Oh, God! Oh, 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 oh. there she is! It's Jay Love! We have been waiting for so long now for Jay Love to make her appearance, and oh, is she making an appearance! God! And she's going to kick it off now here at Mary F and Xmas here in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania at the XPW Arena with America the Beautiful. Oh, oh, the beautiful. I'm Jay Love. <laughs> yes, you are. All right, let's hear it. We see it. We, oh, yeah, we want to hear it. Here we go. This is it. I'm standing up for this one. I think there's uh, some problems with the uh, PA system, oh, perhaps. Magic, or, uh, um, you guys hear me? America, Wait a minute, what is this from behind? America, what the hell's going on here? That's, that's, what? that's Julio De Niro. What is this, a little shucking jiving out here? Oh my God. God, I don't want to look at that. Oh my God. Man ass, not man ass. What is this, Chippendales? Give me a break. Oh my God. Can't show this. When Jayla was, was, I think you could call it singing, America the Beautiful, De Niro comes up. We're a little shucking and jiving. Oh, wait a minute, Chris Candido. What is this? What the hell's going on here at Mary F and Xmas?
Yo. Hey, hold on. Hey, who are you? What are you trying to be a freaking joke, man? Is that what you want to be? You want to be a joke? You want to be a goof? Listen, man, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, from a person who knows, okay? I'm not here to tell you from somebody who knows, all right? I let myself be a crybaby. I let myself do jumping jets. I let myself, I let myself be the friend of all the hey, stop it. Give me some cameras from there, all right? I'm not here trying to help you. I will let myself be the brunt of all the jokes. I've done all the goofy freaking bums. I did everything to try and be an entertainer. And where the hell did it get me? Yeah, I'm here where? I'm the guy that, you know, I'm just telling you, man, I'm telling you, okay? It's not the right way to go, all right? It's not the right way to go. No, no. Hey! trying to tell me. The situation is simple. You and me are not the same person. For one, I am the sexiest man in XPW. Oh, brother. The difference between you and me right here tonight is my star is rising and my friend, you have done a lot of things in this business, but right now Shot right to the head of Julio De Niro, and now it's De Niro to the outside. Chris Candido, well, both these guys going after each other here on the concrete floor in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Down goes De Niro. Who would have thought Mary F and X was going to start out like this tonight? Candido, suplex. And now it's the self-proclaimed sexiest man in wrestling getting his work cut out for him. Now fighting back against Chris Candido. And down goes Candido with a hip toss. Now it's De Niro pounding away on Chris Candido. De Niro with a series of knees right to the back of the neck. The external occipital protuberance area. Right to the guardrail goes Julio De Niro. And now De Niro once again set up for the ride into the other guardrail. Candido go, oh, oh, back body drop. I mean, Santa, Santa went through a lot of work for that. And the, oh, the tree goes down. And I still can't understand what the hell just happened. Candido just trying to give Julio some sound advice, and, and this is what happens? That was ridiculous. That's some hot water? Shoo! All right. I'm going to get this crap off. Oh, God! Oh. Oh. I'm Chris Candido, mother this match going back and forth. Psychosis, Craig and Chetty into position it looks like. Psychosis, go, no, not going upstairs. He's, what is he doing now? He's going for a steel chair on the outside of the ring. Now he's going upstairs. Psychosis with a steel chair in hand. Look at this. Whoa, 360 up and over, but he missed. That steel chair right under him. Chetty, lucky for him, just barely dodging that one. Finnegan counting on both men. Both men struggling, but Chetty to his feet first with a shot to the head to psychosis. Shots from psychosis. Chetty's winded. Another Irish whip. No. Oh, look at that beautiful move from Chetty. And down goes Psychosis. Chris 
Machete with another shot to the head. Right foot connecting to the midsection. And now scissor kick, yes. And down goes, down goes Psychosis. And Psychosis looks like he's out. And this could be it for the pin. One, two, only two. You gotta be kidding me. Psychosis, just barely, just barely kicking out. Job from Chetty once again. Irish whip coming up. And now it's a, a tilt the world. No. Boot to the midsection. Suplex coming up into a face buster. What is this? Oh my goodness. The insane luchador. Super, super crazy. The hell is crazy doing here? Psychosis up and over the top. Psychosis with a senton. Up and over onto the concrete floor. What the hell is crazy doing out here? Super crazy. Of course, you recall slicing the face of psychosis, but from behind, it's Chris Chetty. And here comes the, the security, grabbing super crazy. Oh no, he's got that. He's got that blade again. We got about four or five security guys on top of super crazy. In the meantime, in the middle of the ring, it's Chetty having his way with psychosis. Going for a pin, Finnegan, one, two, only two. The tide of this match turning in the favor of Chris Chetty, due in part that he can thank Super Crazy for this. Super Crazy, I can't believe he actually showed up. Had the call, this guy is insane, he is crazy. From pillar the post now. Up and over goes Psychosis. Chetty, no. A handful of hair, Chetty goes down. Psychosis up top, heel kick, no. Psychosis landing her groin first. Now Atlas Security trying to figure out where Super Crazy took off to. Chetty! The Amityville Horror! And as you can hear, Atlas Security trying to get the super crazy underneath the ring. Referee down only two. As there's obviously another fight ensuing underneath the ring between Crazy and the Atlas Security team. And look at all the chairs, all the carnage coming out from, this is nuts. This is nuts. Atlas Security. Trying to get under the ring, trying to get to the bottom of this. Meantime, in the ring, Psychosis and Chris Chetty trying to get to their feet here. And Atlas having a dickens of a time, trying to get to the insane luchador. Look at this, ladders, tables, chairs. Oh my goodness, what is this? He's cut wide open, it looks like. One of the Atlas security team members Super crazy got to him, obviously, with that blade. We can't even get Atlas to get the insane loot store out of there. It's Psychosis, Chris Chetty in the ring. Well, this is nuts. The Atlas team doesn't know what the hell to do. Psycho stunner. And, and Chetty goes down. One, two, it's over. It's over. Fans, the winner of the match, so Wait a minute. Super. Oh no! No! Damn it! No! Right to the ribs. Stabbed him in the ribs. Super crazy. Oh, not again! No! Damn it! No! And here comes Atlas. If you love the sight of a big white tail buck moving through the brush, the excitement of ducks coming in over. As we see, the entourage, the enterprise, GQ, GQ funny, as far as I'm concerned. And oh, 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 we're on, oh. oh, Christmas is early. Yeah, Veronica Kane, and she's got a present. They got a couple presents. Who's this? Maybe for me, I, I'm up in the crow's nest. Maybe Carl Winslow. Gonna get a little gift. The 
know, maybe I should go easy on this guy. This our ring announcer. His real name isn't Carl Winslow. It's Kingdom Gene. You know, it's Christmas. I guess I'll, I'll be nice to this guy, who he really looks like. More like Emmett Smith, as far as I'm concerned. Nonetheless, Carl Winslow standing in the middle. Well, never mind. And now the Enterprise. This is it. This is the, the, the traditional entrance we always go through when it comes to the Rock Superstar Chaos. Prediction, DQ Money will be grabbing the mic in mere moments. He's eyeing out Kingdom Jane. Now he's giving him a little hug. I don't think James My is in the Christmas spirit. Winslow and all you Philadelphians, show some respect. No, you shut up, you f***ing No, you shut up. Take that off, you Papa Pump Wallaby beat you. What I wanted to say is that usually this lovely lady here and I don't get a proper ring introduction. You better watch yourself, Danny. You better watch yourself, Danny. <laughs> so what I'm gonna need is my buddy Winslow here to introduce her and I. Maybe he is Carl Winslow. Introducing first the challenger from Wildwood, New Jersey, Danny Dory! And now, introducing members of the Enterprise. First, from Hollywood, California, Veronica Kane! And accompanying her to the ring, from Hollywood, California, by way of Aspen, Colorado, GQ Money! That was phenomenal! Finally, an introduction. Winslow, Winslow, I got you a present, man, for Christmas. This is for you. Yeah, exactly. Oh, how sweet I am. Oh. Well, that that is very nice. I gotta admit. I mean, for you. Present. Open it. Open it. Open it now. We don't have to wait till Christmas. Winslow shaking the box. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh man. Oh God. That's so funny. That's funny. Doring, I didn't forget about you. Don't open it, Doring. We already saw it once. Knowing this guy, it'll probably happen again. Maybe snakes this time. Don't do it. Doring shaking the box a little bit. And he threw it back to GQ Money. Oh, look at that fire right between the eyes. Ladies and gentlemen, the man that you came here to see, the XPW Undisputed Television Champion of the World. Throw your hands in the air for the Rock Superstar Chaos. I can't believe it. The match has not even started yet. It's Danny Doring. Danny Doring is blind. How the hell is he going to have a shot at becoming the champion tonight when he's blinded before the match even starts? And Danny Doring is literally out of it, and we haven't even seen Chaos yet. But we know Chaos will be coming through those curtains right now in mere moments. And Doring. Doring doesn't, he can't see. He, he's blind. Blind. And he's got to go against Chaos now for the world television title. Not only is he blind, but look at him. He's living. And, and apparently we didn't get this special enforcer out here fast enough that Danny Doring had requested to Shane Douglas 
of XPW, and there he is, the XPW World Television Champion, The Rock Superstar Chaos, making his way to the ring, with that belt solidly around his waist still, but once again, in my book, the disputed XPW World Television Champion. And look at this, yeah, exactly, going right after Danny Doring. And now, introducing the special guest referee! The Godfather of Referees! Bill Alfonso! Oh, it's Bill Alfonso! You've got to be kidding me! The man who calls it right down the middle! Ponzi, and I'm not talking about Richie's buddy. Ponzi, look at this. And look, whoa, Ponzi taking Chaos's belt off. This has got to be one of the first times ever I've seen Chaos wrestle without his security blanket on. And there goes Danny Doring into the top turnbuckle on the near side. Alfonso going after his belt, but Chaos strapping it right back on. Apparently Fonzie not familiar with Chaos's antics. It's Chaos, the only title holder in the history of professional wrestling to wrestle his entire matches with the strap around his waist. Here he is, the rock superstar Chaos. In all his glory, going upstairs now it looks like. Maybe taking some time out to pull. Doring though to his feet, but oh no, right between the legs. And, oh my god, no! And that is not a step. Alfonso once again, look at this. In the ring the hard way comes GQ Money. And you know Doring has got it out for this guy, not only for what he just did tonight, but for the two previous bouts, all the shenanigans. Doring ahead of steam, look at this. Down goes Money, face first. Oh no, no. I don't even want to see this, oh my goodness! Angel would have loved to be in Chaos's position there. And now it's Dory going right after the man he should be going against. He just took care of GQ Money. He's going right after the television champion, Chaos. From pillar to the post now, Irish Whip. And here comes Dory, a full head of steam. Yes, huge clothesline. And Chaos is down. Chaos on the floor, Danny Dory. With this match well in hand. And the special enforcer, Bill Alfonso. And what is this? Veronica Kane trying to have her way with Dory, but no, Dory. With Veronica Kane in midair, causes her. Oh, look at this up and over. And on top of GQ Money and Chaos. And Dory is taking out the trash. Dory to the Piscato up and over. Lands on both GQ Money and Chaos. It's Miller time, obviously, here. The GQ Money, yes, right between the eyes. And a bag of chips to, to go with them. What is this? Where's the onion dip? Oh, look at this, right, right in the mush. Oh, into the guardrail goes chaos. And who would have thought this would be happening? Danny Dory taking care of not only just chaos, but the entire enterprise after he was blinded. Snapmare takeover on the concrete floor. It's like a slingshot perhaps coming up. No. Into a scorpion deathlock. Right in front of the ring. And look at only if this was in the ring. Chaos tapping out. And Alfonso can see it, but he can't do a damn thing about it. Back into the ring goes Chaos. And of course, the arguments coming from the Enterprise. Irish Whip once again. Drop kick into beauty. And 
Alfonso seems to be neutralizing the normal three on one in this match. Alfonso down, but only a two count. And now Danny Dorian once again with this match in complete control going upstairs. Maybe a little premature celebration there, nonetheless pounding away on the head of the Rock Superstar Chaos. What is this? Not more man ass. Close line, duck underneath. Up and over, sunset flip. Go, go, oh, oh, I smelt that from here. And what the hell is that? Jingle bells, jingle ball bells. Let me ask you this. Was there a sale somewhere on, on, on men's cheese strings or something? I mean, first De Niro, now Dory. Is there just a little too much man moon tonight as far as I'm concerned? I was looking forward to tonight with J-Love and everything. And now I got to see this mumbo jumbo. Nonetheless, Bill Alfonso, once again calling it right down the middle of the chaos. Yeah, arguing with Alfonso, but Alfonso saying, let's get it on for the XPW World Television title. Best of strength, perhaps. Doring Chaos sizing each other up now. Test the strength. No. A knee to the midsection. Boop. Right to the side of the face. From Chaos on to Doring. Elbow. Right to the throat area. Danny Doring. And now it's Chaos. Looks like he's got the upper hand here. Chaos going for a huge clothesline. And Doring just about decapitated. Hey, what's the what's the going for the pin now. Alfonso down, only two. The Rock Superstar Chaos. Kick to the midsection. And Dory could barely stand up, but he just desperation. Nailing Chaos with that low roll. Firing Chaos into the far side. Pillar the post. Irish Whip coming up. And now it's Dory. No! Chaos just barely got those feet up. It catches Doring, and Doring goes flat on his back. And Alfonso right there, checking out Doring. But Chaos, before Doring could even get up, catching Doring, picking him up, scoop up. In a slam position. Landing Doring into the canvas. Give them a little bit of this. Give them a little bit of this. Give it to them, they want it. And now look at this, the Enterprise celebrating once again. And we do not need to see this. We already saw too many G-strings earlier. Damn it. Chaos. What's he have in mind here? Chaos. A little springboard action. Moots on. No. And he missed. Story just barely roll out of the way. Stunner right on top of that top rope. It's Chaos that goes down to the center of the ring. Dory going upstairs. Oh no, look at this. DQ money. Hey. I think Alfonso caught that. I'm standing down here. I'm standing right here. I'm down yeah, sure, here. I believe you. And now chaos with Dory. A superplex coming up, perhaps. Dory shoves chaos off the top rope. Dory from the top. Can he drop? No, he missed. Chaos barely rolling out of the way. And you can see the pain on the face of the challenger, Danny Doring, as Chaos is barely getting to his feet now. You gotta take it. Bill Alfonso right there, checking on both men. Power slam, yes. Very nicely executed from Chaos, the winded champion. Only a one count, Chaos got up. Here we go with the Sharpie again. You gotta be kidding me. Chaos, what a cocky, conceited, arrogant guy this is. 
How the hell is he our champion? This guy makes me sick. As talented as he is, he still makes me sick. Who the hell does this guy think he is? To open these people out, I wouldn't be surprised as far as tonight's been going. He gives a guy. Oh, yeah. Well, autograph. Oh no, Danny Doring, just like that chaos, wasting his time. Got exactly what he deserved here. And Danny Doring with the sharpie. What is this? A little Danny Doring signature and a chop to go along with it. Danny Doring. Once again, taking control of this match as he was before. Danny Doring psyching himself up here in front of this packed house at the XPW Arena. What he's doing exactly, I don't know. Chin lock. Chin lock. Oh, that for a chin lock. The crowd just might start chanting Doring's name pretty soon. Stomps away in the chest cavity of chaos. Forearm shot to the head. Huge chop. You can hear that one echo all the way through the arena, folks. Irish whip coming up from Pillar of the Post once again. Doring misses. Chaos. Scoop Doring up. High above his head. Oh, look at that. That's, that's the RA 2K3. The Rude Awakening 2003. Chaos now with the pin, Alfonso down one, two, and oh, that was close. That was close, and GQ Money thought it was at two. But Danny Doring, Danny Doring's got some left. He's got some gas left in the tank. Chaos with Doring Irish whip. Doring off the ropes, tilt the world, reversal from Doring, reverse DDT, and Chaos goes down. Another one perhaps, yes. Doring going outside, going upstairs. Danny Doring from the top. What is this? Danny Doring, huge rock flash, yes, and he nailed him. Alfonso down one, two, new champion, no, no, that was close. Only two. And Doring, Doring thought he had it as well. Only two. And Doring, Doring thought he had it as well. Doring's got all the momentum right now. And Chaos, Chaos very winded. The Enterprise looking very concerned on the outside of the ring. Danny Doring, arm ringer. Going for the bear back now. No counter by Chaos. Elbow to the back of the head clothesline. Duck underneath another clothesline. And a no. Chaos using the bear back on Doring. Doring down. Alfonso down one, two, oh, only two. Seesaw battle. You know, they say imitation is the most sincere form of flattery. Chaos hitting Doring with his own move. I don't think Danny Doring is feeling flattered right now. Chaos, an Irish whip coming up. Danny Doring, clothesline, duck underneath. Another clothesline, no, up for a crucifix now. It's Danny Doring. Doring going for a Cobra choke. Chaos goes down, and he's trapped with the Cobra choke in the other arm. Trapped in Danny Doring's legs here. GQ Money up on the ring apron. John, oh, Alfonso just shoving, shoving Money off. Turn around Alfonso, because now it's chaos. Veronica Kane, oh, look at this. Alfonso saying, I ain't having none of this woman. Look at, super kick, super kick from Alfonso. Right in the face of Veronica Kane. You gotta be kidding me. Veronica Kane getting exactly what she deserved. Oh no, GQ Money in the ring now, Nayland, Nayland Doring. Some sort of foreign object in his hand. GQ Money rolling chaos on top of Doring. Il 
Alfonso didn't see it, no. Three, it's over. Wait a minute, Alfonso. Alfonso sees the board object. And press knuckles or something. No, that's not mine. Not mine. You gotta be kidding me. The winner of the match by disqualification, Danny Dory. Alfonso reversing the no, no. Alfonso goes down. Chaos. Just nailed referee Alfonso. This is nuts. Remaining XPW Television Champion, The Rock Superstar, Chaos! I can't believe this. Danny Doring wins the match by a disqualification. But of course, this man right here, the disputed XPW World Television Champion, keeps the title. It's Doring and Alfonso Bump laid out in the ring. And the Enterprise, once again, walks away squeaky clean with the title still in their arsenal. When I came to XPW, I knew you guys were extreme. You guys are running in packs now, Daddy. You a bunch of Hollywood rejects. Bill Alfonso came to XPW to call it right down the middle. And I got my ass kicked, didn't I? Well, Bill Alfonso runs in packs all his life. Daddy, I've been in the business for 20 years, and I got friends like you won't believe. And in fact, I'm on my way back right now to get one, Daddy. You want to get a stream? Well, get a stream, Daddy. This ain't the last of Bill Alfonso, Daddy. Want to play better golf? Well, you could spend hundreds of... Oh, toy fluke. Did you really think you were going to hold on to this title? It's my belt again. Did you really think this would be around your waist still? This is my belt. All you did was shine it up for me, and you didn't even do that good of a job. You didn't have any help from anybody, anybody to come and take it from me? No. One-on-one, -on -one, I beat you. Now, the commission. What's your problem? You, you try, try to, to take, take the, the death, death match, match away from, from us. You think I'm stupid? I showed you what I could do. And there's no one in XPW who can take this away from me. They made me come up with new ways to torture people. No one's going to beat me at my own game. Since I've taken on everyone in XPW. Everybody that you now. Everybody in XPW for this belt. There's no one left. This is a friend's time. Open challenge. So I'm issuing a challenge. Open challenge. Anybody that wants to come for this. Anybody. Anywhere. I think the fans would like to see that. Open challenge. Open challenge. Not to take away from the exciting bout we just saw between Psychosis and Chris Chetty. Psychosis on a huge roll here at XPW getting the win over Chris Chetty. But Super Crazy has gone off the deep end. This guy has flown over the cuckoo's nest. Frank Talon, the Pennsylvania State Athletic Commissioner who was at ringside when this all went down, demands that Super Crazy seek psychological evaluation and must have approval from the state of Pennsylvania before returning to XPW. This poses the question, will Super Crazy be at the XPW Arena Friday night, January the 17th for New Year's Revolution? Will he be there Saturday night, January the 18th for the aftermath? And on this huge weekend, we're gonna give you information on the big Q&A session you, the fans, can ask the stars of XPW all the questions that have been burning up inside of you. And tickets are on sale 
for this extraordinary weekend, you can call the XPW box office toll free 1-866-888-4336. Of course, you can also log on to XPWrestling.com Friday night, January the 17th at XPW's New Year's Revolution, a special 9 p.m. start. However, the doors will open at 6 p.m. And at 7 p.m., the Enterprise will reveal their home video and Veronica Kane, GQ Money, Chaos will all be there for a very special autograph signing. Fans already signed for Friday night, January the 17th at XPW's New Year's Revolution. The newest superstars here in XPW that seized the moment and became XPW World Tag Team Champions. Euthanasia will be going against the team that they beat to win the titles, Mexico's Most Wanted. And the challenge has been laid out. Angel and Shark Boy will face off with Southern Comfort, Tracy Smothers, and Chris Hamrick. The Rock Superstar Chaos will have the night up Friday night, January the 17th at XPW's New Year's Revolution because the Four Corners match at Mary F and Xmas was inconclusive, therefore, Jerry Lynn and Johnny Storm will battle one-on-one -on -one to determine who gets the shot at chaos Saturday night, January 18th, at the Aftermath. Fan Supreme has laid out the open challenge for the King of the Deathmatch title, and this match will take place not Saturday night, but only Friday night. And you saw it, Mary F and Xmas, how innovative the King of the Death match was. You ain't seen nothing yet because on Friday night, January the 17th, it's going to be a death match like none other. But the question is who? Who will challenge Supreme for the King of the Death Match Championship? Will we find that out next week? Only time will tell. Fans, this is Chris Kloss saying. So long.